What's happening guys? Welcome back to Planet Crafters. Thanks for joining me and if you're new, welcome to the channel. Last episode, we found another place to put the warden's key and a cave system with a giant door. We explored, but to be perfectly honest, it wasn't all that exciting in there. We found a couple more warden's keys. We have three now. Two of which I have on me. Um, but first I want to build that new optimizer and put it over there with all, everything that's running. So let's see what we need to do. Uh, let's see, Q optimizer right here. Actually, it's not very hard to build. Let's pin that up. Right, we need to make another explosive. I think that's easy enough to do. Sulfur and iridium. You know what? I'm pretty sure we have sulfur over there. Yeah, we did. Oh, and we have an explosive. That's fine. We'll make two anyway. Okay, iridium rod. Um, which is right here. No, not ir nope, nope. Uranium. Two iron, one cobalt. Alright, let's put this bad boy over here. Oh, we need an optimizer though. Stuff. So we have a few of them. We have pressure, oxygen, and heat. I'm really thinking probably pressure. I think. Well, we're gonna grab one of each and see what these whoops. See what these machines are doing out here. So this one does pressure and a little bit of heat. Look at all this sulfur. And it does not disappear. This has been laying here for like weeks. Eh, probably a week. What does this thing do? Also pressure and heat. I'm thinking we put it somewhere around here. More meteors? Kind of sounds like it. Yep. Alright, let's build this right here. Oh, that's not very big. Radius. Oh, yeah, it is. It's a giant radius. Is that gonna work for everything? I think so. Let's see, so that was pressure and heat. Let's check the screen right quick. Um, we got that, and this tells us what's going to open up next. There's a T4 heater. Tier 4 drill would be great. That requires heat. 37, what are we at? Uh, aren't we there? 37.18. Oh no, that's 41. We're almost there, actually. How about the pressure? Flower spreader, gas extractor. I'm thinking we do pressure. I think the oxygen's probably fine. Water life collector. Yeah, we're gonna do pressure. Heat. Okay, pressure. 500%. So these should be doing more, right? 
Yeah. Awesome. All right. I mean, technically, we can build a couple of those. But it's... I think it's covering all of that. Okay, let's put some of this junk away. We'll put this away. And we're gonna go explore some more. I'm gonna bring two Warden's keys with me just in case. Uh, you know what, though? No, we'll bring one. And I found another cave system over there, so we're gonna go explore that. And hopefully find freaking tier two plant rocket. Oh, sweet. Where would that be? Plant rocket. Oh. That's gonna be over here. There's map information. Super alloy rod. Yeah, we're not ready for that yet. Plant rocket. We don't have tree bark, so we can't do that yet. All right, cool. There's a lot, a lot uh, happening right now. Oh, you know what? We can get rid of the. Uh... There, get rid of that. All right, I'm gonna eat, grab some water, and then I will meet you. It's I can't remember. I think it's like right. Directly on the other side of this mountain. Pretty close to where the other warden stuff was. Okay, here it is. Oh shit, I just broke my damn legs. And there's also something over there. So if we have time, we'll go over there to investigate all that stuff. But first, I want to check this out. See what this is all about. It'd be awesome if there was another Warden's Key door in here. And there's a chest. What are these things? Can we do anything? Nope. Can't do anything with them. Uh, guess we'll take the uranium. I think this is just a resource cave. Oh my god, it's going really deep. Um, and ice is blocking the way, I think. Yeah. Don't think we can get in here just yet. Oh, maybe. Nope. Nope, can't get there. Not just yet. Alright, let's go check that other location. All right, we're in that other location I was talking about. It almost looks like these things might be stacked. No, I thought it was stacked, maybe man-made, but I don't think it is. But there's an awful lot of them. The light doesn't do very good out here. Oh, oxygen. Oh, there's definitely another wreck. I think this is a wreck. I don't know what this is. There's a, a crate over here. Let's go grab that real quick. God, the light does not enjoy the, uh, the dust. Oh my god, look at the rockets. We're taking those. Okay. Let's see if we can get a way in, find a way in this place. Oh, come on, please tell me there's a way in. Oh, 
Oh, right there. And we're in. All right. So let's, um, I guess we'll start on the right. See if we can find anything over here. The hell? Oh, tier three heaters. What do we get for those? I forgot. Titanium, silicon, iridium rods. All right, we don't really need any of this. I'll take the rods. I mean, we do need the aluminum, but I'm not gonna bog up inventory when we're doing this stuff. Can't go that way. Can't get rid of that. That's where we came in. That's seriously all that was? No, no it's not. What the heck is this? Can't do anything with it. We're gonna take the uranium. Because we're short on the uranium rods. Those are... Those look like guns. Cannons of some sort. There's another multiplier. I don't know that we need any more. I'm pretty sure we have a bunch of these. See what's over here. Nothing in there. Satellites. Easily get lost in your uh Actually this is probably easier to get out. You just it's only one direction. A big ship though. That'll screw you over. What's happening here? Three hundred, some iridium. I expected more from this place, you know, like tier two. Uh, what is it called? Deconstruction, something or other. Yeah, there's nothing else in here. I think that's the end of the ship. Take the fertilizer. And the rod. Yeah, that's all that was in here. Nothing too exciting. God damn it. Come on now. Can I get rid of that door? Yep. There's at least one crate in here. No microchips, though. Yeah, this was just nothing more than a storage crate. A big one, but that's all it was. Well, shit. All right, guess I'll uh, bring you back when I find something interesting or meet you at base. Hey guys, oh shit, sorry, just slammed my hand right in the mic. Um, not only is it getting kind of green down there, but look what I just found. I don't know what it does. I don't see a door anywhere near here. I have no idea where the door is. But, um... We're doing it. Oh my god, this takes three. God damn it, I needed the other two. Okay, um... I'm gonna go back to base, drop all this shit off. Grab the other warden keys. And I will meet you right here. We made it back. And actually, right here, that crate, it had a microchip in it. 
So now we have a microchip and a couple other things. Okay. Here we go. I don't know what's going to happen. Holy shit, it's a whole freaking rock. Oh, and we have a tier 4 drill, so that's good. Jesus. What the hell did we just open up? Oh my god. Oh, you son of a bitch. We need more heat. God damn it. Um, that sucks. Actually, I could probably go right up and over. Come on. Let's see what's over here. Oh, nope. Can't. No jetpack. They made sure you couldn't do that. But look at it. Look at this. And we can't get there because of that goddamn ice. Even if we did get in there, we'd be stuck in there. Damn, that sucks. Oh, are we gonna get in? Oh shit, look, I think I just cheesed it. Oh no, we're gonna die. We're gonna die! Holy shit. <laughs> and we're in. We cheesed it. Ancient Paradise, that's the achievement that Steam just gave me. Okay, so we would come in from over here. I have no jetpack. I think we come in from over here. Yeah, right here. Two GTI. I don't know what GTI means. This place looks freaking beautiful. It's a hidden oasis back here. Wow. You know, I think we just cheesed endgame stuff. Oh, shit. Be pretty cool to see an animal, right? I mean, it looks like it's perfect to run into one. Oh, here's another key. Might as well take it. It's freaking gorgeous. Oh, come on, Storm. I'll bring it back when the storm's done. Okay, Storm has passed. Look at this. This is a screenshot and a half, isn't it? Holy crap. Alright, I gotta get a good angle. That pillar's like right in the middle of everything. Let's see. Yeah, that'll work. It's a friggin' sweet screenshot. Go right. That's good. Alright, let's start exploring. Now, the one thing I do know is it was sheer luck that we had all three Warden's keys. So now that I know that we need to collect them all, because some of these might take multiple keys to get in, assuming there's more. I don't know if this is actual endgame. Sure seems like it would be. But, on that note, oh look, there's another key right here. Okay, yeah, I, I doubt there's, uh, I doubt this is endgame. 
Makes me want to search every little corner. I don't think there's anything else over here. Okay, we gotta kind of sort of hurry. We only have three oxygen left. Anything over here? Mm, stairs going up. Hopefully don't fall through the world again. Holy crap. Now this is identical to the other one. Oh man, it just keeps going up though. Should we keep going up? I mean, we're here, right? Might as well. We can climb that. All right, hold on. We got to search. Search everything. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I guess we're climbing. Look at another key. Holy crap. Look at this. If we fall, we're screwed. Also, my health is not doing great. This looks freaking amazing. All right, let's head back down. So we came from there. We climb? Is there something to climb? No. That's just a really bad fall. There's another key. Yeah, I don't want to run too much. The last thing I want to do is make a mistake and fall to my death and then have to work all the way back over here. Where did I see the key? Yeah, look at this. Jesus, four keys. Okay, we came up from there. I guess let's go over here. See if there's anything. And it's a bit chuggy on the uh, frames. So I apologize for that. Doesn't look like... So we can go up from there. Let's go down, check every little corner. I mean, I kind of want to check all this first before we head into there. Actually, it looks like... Does it go further back? Oh man, we're going to have to go over there. This is really cool. So bitchin'. Another screenshot. Perfect. I'm worried I'm gonna miss something. So since we're getting so many warden keys, I don't think this is endgame. There's probably something more. We're going over here. Up some more. Please don't fall. That would suck. Oh boy. Oh my gosh, it just keeps going. There's another key. Five keys. I hope we're not missing one. <laughs> Everyone look around. Tell me what you see. Find another key. I don't think there's anywhere else to go from here. 
Doesn't look like it. I don't see a key down there. All right, let's head back down. Two oxygen left. We're really, um, uh oh. Don't, please don't get stuck. Don't you dare do that to me. All right, we need to hurry. Okay, we already got that key. I don't think we went up here. Doesn't look like there's a key here. No. Much oxygen. We have two left. And that's where they go. Let's read this real quick. Once we live. Okay. Yes. Maybe this is endgame. Ready? Here we go. The hell? Uh, another screenshot? There, a couple more. All right, and we're in. Oh my god, look at this. Hydration level, son of a bitch, please. Okay, I do have water. We're gonna do that. What the hell? All right, here we go. Once again, calamity befalls our people. If the predictions are correct, a meteor will hit the planet in just a few days. The cities we built, the splendors we created, will fall. Our arts, traditions, discoveries, and lives will vanish. Once again, destruction is upon us, but this time, we will not flee, as we did generations ago. What is the point of running away when demise chases you so vigorously? We accept our fate. We accept our fate, our proud of what we are, and remain true to our values. Our story will disappear under the ashes of flames and dust, like a butterfly life, beautiful and ev evanescent. It's time to meet our end, a warden. Holy crap. Well, that explains that giant asteroid impact over there. Alright, let's see. What do we get? Here's another chip. What is this thing? Golden butterfly larva. Oh my god. Another effigy. There's a 600. I mean, do we really need all this? Probably. And no, we'll take it until we can't. Hell yeah. 600. Another larva. Dude. Well, now we know that these people... Well, they had a really hard go of it. Butterflies are alive, though. Everything's still alive. That's pretty epic. Well, we know that was the end of the story, so that was definitely, like, endgame story. But it's not endgame for us. We still have a lot to explore. We have more chips to unlock. Two more. Uh, where'd they go? Oh, right here. We got some butterfly larvae, so we can start getting into... Uh, insects and animals at some point. Got some more effigies. Alright, that was fun. That was awesome. Can we take all these back? Nope, they're done for. About another screenshot. Perfect. Sweet. All right. Well, I'm going to meet you back at base. Got a bit of a long hike. I don't know if I can even get out of here. I might have to wait until I just die. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to wait till I die. There's no getting out of this. No jetpack. All right, I'll see you at base. All right, and we're back. That was pretty epic. I think that was um, the end of the Warden's Key stuff. I doubt there's going to be more than that. So let's see, what do we get? We got a bunch of stuff. Let's read those chips. Please be the Tier 2. Tier 3 GPS. Tier 2 Deconstruction. Hell yeah. Alright. That is freaking awesome. Um, we're gonna build... God damn, it is really chugging along. Alright, we're gonna... Build the Tier 2 stuff and uh, come up with a new plan. Start building some more stuff. Maybe try to get um, some of the butterfly stuff going too. I want to thank you guys for joining me. You guys are awesome. Thank you for all the support. If you want to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe. This is Wobble Pop Gaming, and I will see you in the next one.